Duan, and welcome to Tsuki no Ame, where we try Japanese snacks and treats. Today we have two snacks to try from Tokyo Treat, so I'm going to be honest, the more I've learned about these, the more nervous I am. Uh, so first we're going to try, on the custom sheet, it said that these were garlic potato chips. They left out a very important word. These are apparently garlic shrimp flavored potato chips. Um, and if you've been on the channel for the last couple of months, you might be aware of this, but lately we've gotten a lot of um, fish and seafood flavor snacks where just something about them is just not working for me. Um, at least not for me personally, and maybe that it works fine for you. It's been really weird because I love fish and seafood, but the flavored snacks have not They've just not been working. Um, so this has me very nervous because I love potato chips. I love Japanese potato chips. But I'm really concerned about them being shrimp flavored. Uh, we are also going to try this is the fried squid senbei. According to the culture guide, this is supposed to taste like uh, squid tempura. Again, very nervous. For the same reason, actually more so because squid, there have been a couple where it's kind of worked, but squid has just never worked, at least for not for me. I am actually going to film another episode after this. I have scheduled, um, the, the next one I'm filming is, has a treat that I have been really looking forward to since we got into the box. So we're going to try these. See how they turned out, and then uh, tomorrow, I'm hoping, will be a much better day. So let's get started. Itadakimasu! Okay. Oh, yay, you smell very fishy. It's like the fish that's been out for a while type of smell. It's, oh, yeah, I'm, well, and then, so when we first started doing this, we got a lot of uh, Koyakea brand potato chips, and they were beautiful, they were perfect, but lately we've been getting some of these style, and they're not my favorite. Please bring back the Koyakea pride line. Please. I hate them. I hate them. The, so it's like they molded the potato chip kind of like um, a Pringles chip, but they made them thicker and more unpleasant. I thought at first, okay, maybe this can survive because the taste of the garlic is strong, but then the shrimp flavor kicked in. I hate them. I really do. I generally like garlic. I hate these chips. I just, I can't, I cannot. Moving on to our fried squid. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Oh. Um, yeah. We're breaking that to a smaller... So apparently they're supposed to be about this size, shaped like a squid. Um, a lot of them, they, they seem kind of stuck together. I cannot... I... I can't, I can't. Okay, those are better. Not as much of the squid flavor as I was getting of the shrimp flavor. The flavor of the breading is actually pretty good. Um, it tastes like they captured some of the sauce flavor in there. It's still, it has a nice crunchy texture. The texture is actually pretty pleasant. 
still not a huge fan. I'd try something from this line again if it were not seafood flavored. I would love to never see this kind of abomination again. Goju so sama. So to recap real quick so I can get water. We tried our garlic shrimp Japanese style chips. Just don't. Just just spare yourself. Uh, they're not the nice potato chips where it's like a sliced potato that was fried. This is the weird they made a potato patty and call it a chip. Um, if you like that sort of thing, grab a can of Pringles. That will taste better than these. We also tried the fried squid zembe, which, um, it was definitely better. If you're feeling adventurous, maybe give it a shot. Um, I cannot recommend, though, I do not like either of these at all. Well, thank you so much for joining me today. Uh, if you like my shirt, link for that is down in the description below. Please don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. Johnny.